Trail Dogs, one of the more debatable aspects of MTB. You either love them or hate them. At GGMTB, we've got two different Trail Dogs. They both have their positives and negatives, and good things about them are just general things that are positives about Trail Dogs. Later, we'll talk about the worst things in another video. So let's just get into the top 10 best things about having a Trail Dog. Number one, trail dogs make for good company. When you're on a ride in the middle of the bush and the closest person to you being up to five kilometers away, it's nice to know that you have someone watching you as you shred through the bush hitting all the best features. It can be nerve-wracking knowing that if something goes wrong, it could be hours or even days before someone gets to you. A trail dog can provide confidence and be a good thing to talk to when you're in the bush far off from civilization. Having a trusty mate for you on your long journey can always make it better. Number two, trail dogs can do some funny things while you're out for a ride. Whether you're out in the bush filming or just cruising around, having a trail dog can make for some memorable moments. Dogs can do some odd things while filming. Here are some clips that we've just managed to gather up of the dogs doing some quite funny things. Oh, there's an echidna. That's what you want. Number three, they take all the flies away. This is a simple one. When we're making our 10 hour challenge, there are a lot of marks of horse flies around because it was pretty hot. And uh, Tonga was made for a great fly magnet. Uh, he really took him in. Number four, they can be really fun to race. This is a lot less general positive, but it's still a positive. Your trail dog is fast and loves to run. This one will apply to you. Our trail dog, Tonga, he cannot get enough of racing other dogs. Whenever we're passing any dogs, he loves to race them. Just, just bolts with them. It's very fun to try and keep up with him. He's pretty fast and we'll play footage of us trying to race him now. Tonka one. No surprise there. Number five, dogs love to shred. If you ever with your trail dog, you might notice that they do not give any obstacle a second thought. They send everything. They love shredding down hard corners, fanging down steep hills, and going over the jumps. It's quite cool to watch them jump and do all those things, and it makes a great content. We'll play some footage of trail dogs shredding down some th things, doing jumps, drops, all that. Number six, a trail dog will always stay by your side. After having a huge crash, you hit the ground hard. Your legs and arms hurt so much that you can't even feel them or move them to get up. You close your eyes. As you do so, a familiar feeling goes in your face. It's wet. Feels kind of gross. But you open your eyes only to see all the pain go away because your best mate, your trusty trail dog, is there next to you. You get back on your bike and you keep on going. Number seven, they can find new tracks. If you're down shredding through the bush, it's really easy to miss tracks. But dogs, they they, they notice these things. And whenever you're out with a dog, you might notice that they'll, they're slightly ahead of you. They might, you know, veer off a little, look down a track, but keep going. They're great for finding tracks and you can find some of the best tracks when riding with them. This really shows, and this can help you find cool features to practice on, show your mate. You never know what you can find out there. It's quite good, and it's really a positive of having a trail dog with you. Number eight, having a trail dog can make some great content. This only really applies to other YouTubers. But having a trail dog with you can really make for some good quality content. As the week-to-week -week struggle of just finding something to put out so that the YouTube algorithm doesn't stop promoting you can be really hard. Having a trail dog can help you generate ideas. This one really perfectly segues into the next point. Number nine, having trail dogs can add characteristics to your YouTube channel. Now, this one is the perfect time to introduce the two different trail dogs that you will be seeing on GGMTB. The first one is the one you've all seen. You've seen it all the time. It's Tonka. He's really, he's mainly the points we've been doing this video on. He's one that inspired the video. 
because we're just seeing Tonka and like, oh, you know, a new video out of him. You all know Tonka. And, yeah, but we have one other dog. It's been in a few videos. You haven't really seen it that much. It's been in a... It's just in a bit in the background. This is Oscar and Jack's dog called Marley. She's a Kelpie, and she's she's a bit too young right now to actually come and ride with us. But here's some photos and videos of her, just so you know you get to know her. Now I hope no one can count because that was only nine reasons. But do not get us wrong. We absolutely love having trail dogs with us down at GGMTB. We ride with them nearly every ride. They just add to the ride so much as you've seen. But next week, we'll tell you 10 reasons not to ride with a trail dog. If it's out already, it'll be in the description. Go down and check if it's there. And let us know if you like this style of video, the more top hop 10 styled videos. If you like them, comment below. Just let us know. Give us a like or whatever, just so we know, and then we'll create more of these videos. But anyway, we'll see you in the next one.